Are you guys talking about a specific thing? Because that went over my head. No. Okay. No. What's going we on? Just shot. I was like, there is too straight of a line. Too straight of a line for you guys to have just made that up. mental time is the time that like i woke up at five so this is our well, well check coming off the same amount of work yeah i i will woke for the amount of time to which be is work. still for me that's still physical time because you still have that many hours at work the physical amount of hours well, i don't know work. which one's which but <laughs> is it, is it, isn't time relative yes so what is time? time on the spec <laughs> <laughs> Darren, we're gonna have to cut right there. I love hey, that. well, I not. I see, well, if you think about it, since you know that is a spectrum, wouldn't everyone be somewhere on that spectrum? Yes. So then, <laughs> the thing about swings is they I go both ways. <laughs> you're autistic, and it's not an insult because I'm autistic. Oh my goodness, we are gonna have to cut all of this, Tanner. <laughs> We need to save it though. Uh, Keep a hold of it. And everything gets saved. (laughs) It gets used. (laughs) Blackmail later. Do we want to do a little bit of small talk first? I I was going to, but but then you guys said, My (laughs) name's Nick. I'm a little autistic. (laughs) Well, if you're a little autistic, I'm a little autistic. (laughs) I mean, can't we all agree here that we're all autistic? Like, with (laughs) Tanner, be real here. None of us are normal. Anyways. Small talk. We're going to start now. Um, we're all in school, right? Yeah. How's everyone's first week? Not good. <laughs> I went to one day and missed the other. You had work or just didn't want to go? I had to go to Vegas. Nice. Yeah. Oh, what for? Shoot, nice. Nice. He's sick of doing it in the bathroom. He had to go down to Vegas to actually do it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> What about you? You doing online or are you uh, in person? I'm half and half. Okay. So I've got two in person classes Tuesday, Thursday. So nice. pretty nice. chill. I have right. sports in person classes and labs in person, but my actual lectures are online. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah. What about you, Colby? Oh, I got. She's just getting regs. <laughs> oh, awful. How many, I, how many credits are you taking? 15. That's not horrible. I mean, I'm taking on the credits. <laughs> well, I'm true, taking true. tax yeah. one, fifteen audit of my one, credits, <laughs> no biggie. Financial accounting two, <laughs> fifteen one credit classes, <laughs> keyboarding online. <laughs> Take that twice. <laughs> got credit both times. Uh, got class three classes on Tuesdays and Thursdays from ten to four at school oh, all day long. Tough. And then Wednesday, Monday, Wednesdays, I got class from nine to three. And then Tough. Fridays only have one class from nine to ten, That's which is nice, nice. But yeah, I've got Americans in the Outdoors and film, where we watch movies. Lucky. Oh, those I are my took two in-person class. ones. I took that class. It was great. I've had class twice and I've fallen asleep once. So <laughs> if I can maintain that fifty percent, I'll be good. Do you have to write essays on them? Oh no, no. Okay, because mine. I thought it was going to be like that, but we didn't actually have to do that. I think we had to do it on like two of them. We had to write like a you synopsis. Just watched them. Yeah. Well, we watched them and then. I got to sign a movie to watch for homework. <laughs> nice. like, we had to do that too. Nice. We had to watch one outside of class. We had to rent it from Amazon Prime. It was called uh, uh, The Room or something like that with Brie Larson. Okay. Never it heard of it. An interesting, interesting movie. Hmm. So Yeah. We're doing like the history. So we just talked about. Uh, what's that actor's name? From all the silent films, oh, like, oh, Charlie Chaplin. That, not, yeah, that's yeah. Like yeah. Charlie Chaplin. Um, and now, like, I'm assigned to watch like a short film, so it's just like I don't know. It's kind of cool because like there's different types of art what you should watch. Mm-hmm. Lava, the Disney short film. <laughs> watch all the Tomater short films. <laughs> Tomater, <laughs> Tomater. Yeah. Mater's Tall Tales. How are they going to tell you Listen, they're not short dude, films? Tokyo Drift Mater. <laughs> Did I say coded. short films? I was meant to be saying silent films. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. <laughs> There's a difference. That's very different. Lava's literally a song. That would be. Yeah, I was like, well, how did we get on this topic right now? I was like, <laughs> I'm picturing like black and white classical music, you know, and you're like, Tomater. And I'm like, I've been an uncle for like two months. <laughs> yeah, so uh, maybe maybe that's in the curriculum. I'll let you know. Yeah, it's part of so. history. It's right on. Yeah. The fun part of history. All right. Are we ready to get started? Yeah. Yes, sir. Okay, 
So my topic today is based off of legal and illegal things and laws and what Matt made up. So you guys get to take a guess at which is which. Okay. I have just a short list of just real versus fake things. I'll let you guys discuss about each one. And I'll and then if something is legal or illegal? Or if yeah. you made it up. Or if I made it up. And I'll disclose okay. after. Okay. So you ready? Yes, sir. Let's see what you got. First one. <clears throat> so this is like, is it illegal or illegal? Like, are you going to get arrested or are you fine doing it? Using a fake name online. I feel like that depends on where you're at. I don't feel like that's... Well, a, yes, all of these are conditional. Ooh. But is there a penguin. set <laughs> scenario where you can? I'm sure there is. Yes. Or sorry, where you can be arrested for it. I'm sure there is. Um, Is there more context to it? Or is it just yeah, online? Because like, <laughs> if you're doing it in a bad manner to get certain types of people to certain locations to... <laughs> have certain things happen to these people then it's illegal and you can you can what does this say so much worse if you're like trying to be vague if you're trying to kidnap somebody <laughs> then this can't be legal so in that sense no but i mean club penguin pop tropica i did not use tanner davis oh yes what was it then i can't remember those it's been a long time names I use Dad's uh, Duke. well you have you, name you have favorite display hockey player. names i guess and i never used my name as a display name Okay. My display name was always my username. So I would say it was illegal. Yeah. Illegal? Okay. Yeah. First one. Illegal. <laughs> Cha-ching. Are you wanting me to put like a sound effect? Sure. Go <laughs> ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Plots. I'm going to use that. Cha-ching. Okay. <laughs> Underage <laughs> drinking. Underage drinking Underage of? Underage drinking of beer or alcohol. That's illegal. Where? Well, in all you, the United States, the United well, anywhere States? it's yes, well, we're we're talking about the U.S. Anywhere there is a legal limit that would make it underage. That's true. I guess that's true. I didn't well, think about that. Technically, I I think this is a federal law within it. Is if you have your legal guardian, your parent, or whoever next to you, mm -hmm. you can order what you want at a bar and have what you want and drink with them. And that See, probably depends on the location. The probably bar, and and the bartender. Probably. Or the restaurant owner. I don't know. Huh. So it's illegal to buy alcohol for a minor. Yeah. Yes. Correct. Which is essentially what your parents are doing. Right. Yes. So it's illegal for them, but not illegal for you. Yes. But the question. Like, but that's not if the you question. Go, that's not the question. If you go out to the beer garage, you know, or the beer fridge in the garage, and you like crack a cold partake, one. Yeah. You sneak one. Is that illegal? Your dad wasn't trying to give it to you. But you still drank un underage. You drank so. it underage. So technically, that is illegal. Well, I think it also depends on where, though, because if you're on private property. Well, that's where it gets dodgy, though. That's too. another story, right? And, you know, there's a lot of things. I'm going to say illegal because it's bad. Ill illegal. I think it's legal. He's going to say legal, though, right? Yeah. It is 100% legal in certain, certain in circumstances. In Kansas. No, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 In specific the circumstances. The only good thing in Kansas. <laughs> and corn. Uh, let me find corn. it real quick. Well, Kobe's going to be spot on. Like His yeah. definition his, is accurate, his, and then he voted against it. His are actually really good. So minors can drink legally on private property with parental presence and consent. Um, so nothing about my scenario was legal, <laughs> but both no. of yours was good. Yeah, and that's 29 states. Um, 25 where minors can drink for religious region reasons. That checks out. That, oh, yeah. Um, yeah. 16 for medical reasons. 11 for education. Hold up, hold up, hold Can up, I get on the up, medical up. reasons? Yeah, what's, what's <laughs> medical beer? Yeah, so like. I'm just trying uh, to numb it, the pain. It used to be where like <laughs> if you were getting <laughs> surgery and you were allergic to different oh, kinds of things. Oh, they'd give you beer? No, you wouldn't take beer. Beer's oh. nothing. You'd take like freaking gin. Vodka? Vodka? Vodka. No, you take. I mixed vodka uh, and tequila. Is your vodka gluten free? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, you take like 15% alcohol, which is really strong. <laughs> some moonshine? Yeah, like you take, you take some real strong stuff for hey, medical Darren, reasons. Can we set up a still in your backyard now and say it's for religious reasons? <laughs> yeah. I was thinking like Done. wine Yo, sacrament. Let's just start a church. 
Tax write-off, baby. <laughs> Non-profit? Yes. I don't want to get struck right now, yeah. so maybe yeah. I'll call it a church. Just call it a non-profit. And then there are six states where minors can drink on private property without parental presence or consent. Hmm. So, Is one of them Kansas? I don't know. It doesn't list them. Okay. Probably is Kansas. Probably like the Dakotas. <laughs> Probably. Give me, a, give me a little ka-ching right here, Tanner. Ka-ching. If Kansas is one of them. <laughs> Um. Okay. Playing poker with a group of friends. Um. That's legal. You don't have to. Do you have to be twenty? You do have to be twenty-one to gamble. I think you. Casinos have got to like or eighteen have a twenty-one a gambling license, right? Yeah, they they have to apply for a license. Correct. Yeah. But you see, he just said playing poker, not betting. There's no No. betting. Playing poker. No, I'm sure like that's part of it. Yeah. Relatively large monetary value involved. That's illegal. With friends? With friends. I feel like that's... Is there an age? No. No, that's legal. Yeah. Because if you're amongst friends and there's consent... Keyword. It's legal. (laughs) Keyword. (laughs) (laughs) I'm going to say legal. No, because who's to define friends, you know? (laughs) Who's to define consent, you know? (laughs) Who's to define poker? (laughs) You sound worse than Tanner now. <laughs> a drug oh, yeah, deal going on. on. <laughs> Five. <laughs> I say it's illegal. I'm probably somewhere in the middle. I'm sure there's some states that are like, oh, no, that's illegal, and some states that are legal. So I'll be Switzerland here. I'll be Switzerland. <laughs> it is, in fact, illegal. You could be arrested if you are playing a poker game with a total revenue of more than $2,000 and you do not have a license. Oh. Oh, okay. What if it's strip poker and you're wearing lingerie? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it has any bearing. Well, is the say... lingerie worth more than $2,000? <laughs> that's, that's the question. That's why it's got to be lingerie. <laughs> when you said relatively large monetary value, I'm thinking like hundreds of thousands, yeah. close to millions, not 2000 <laughs> which to some people is a lot. To me, that's a lot. But like... Well, yeah, but if you, think, if playing, you say it like when that, I, when I say with your friends, a relatively large is different than saying okay, okay, professionally okay. playing poker. I guess there was some that's context that issues out. there. If it's a Tuesday night, like you're not who's gonna, dropping if, two G's yeah, who's, on a yeah. poker yeah. game. No one like Checks you don't out. have five friends that are each putting four hundred dollars in on poker. Good that's point. rare. What if you have two hundred friends putting ten dollars in? Then you're screwed. That's also, a long game also of poker. rare to have two hundred <laughs> friends. Tanner, do you even know two hundred people? I'm sure I could rattle off 200 people's names. Give me a yearbook, and I'll tell you if I know. Well, what's your definition of know somebody? N- know their name and see them on the street and could say hi, and they would at least would they could place you? you. Okay, okay. So I know them, they know me. Yeah. yeah. Or know of, recognize Yeah. Them. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I yeah. could do it. I could do it. Tanner got around in high school. Like, not in that way. Like, he, was, <laughs> he knew people. <laughs> Yeah, he, I, he knew people. I consider myself Sorry, Cam. <laughs> not popular, like popular, popular, but I feel like I knew a lot of people. And a lot of people kind of knew of me, at least, or at least of the car I drove. Yeah. The pickle. Oh. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so. She <laughs> got around. <laughs> 12, 12 I passengers. Lots drinking of people green rode man. on my pickle. <laughs> like, all the pickle. Speaking of pickles. <laughs> no, it doesn't have to do with pickles. But, anyways. Well. Is it legal for any person, male or female, to be topless in public? I think that's a depends on where you are. So yeah, where situation there again. are three specific states that are different, but is it legal or illegal for someone to be topless? Just the act of being topless. I'm going to say it's illegal, but they don't enforce it with certain people. Dudes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like dudes can walk around shirtless and no one really blinks an eye, but if a girl's walking around shirtless, everyone's going to be looking. Still nobody blinks, though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go illegal. Obviously, there's probably some exceptions, I'm sure, but... No shoes, no shirt, no service, so illegal. Yeah, that checks out. Wait, what do you guys think the exception states are? New York. Certain parts of... California. I'd say California. Like beaches. Just because of certain, all the beach certain, certain Certain beaches. But also, like, I mean, besides the fact that any dude can just walk around shirtless and nobody cares, like, if you're going on a run as a dude, nobody's going to blank an right. eye. I've dude. seen some very old people that should definitely be wearing a lot more layers. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> yeah. Ching. Ching. Okay, well, you are all wrong. Oh, what? Bummer. In most U.S. states, it is just as legal for a woman to go topless as it is for a hmm. man. <laughs> Notable exceptions. Did you guys want to take guesses now that you know that direction? Oh, like a park? Utah. No, no, no. States. Oh, Utah. <laughs> Any others? Watch it not be Utah. Utah, Montana, South Dakota. Final answer. Kansas, uh, Nebraska, <laughs> Louisiana. Wait, uh, not Louisiana. Sorry, not New Orleans. Louisiana. <laughs> <laughs> Forgot about that. Mardi Gras. <laughs> it's coming up. Colorado, Kansas, Oklahoma. Colorado. I like how you guys both left Utah. No, it's Indiana, Tennessee, and Utah. Um, really? So some local laws ban <laughs> female breast bearing, but their local law is not federal. Mm-hmm. And free the eight. name <laughs> in 2023. <laughs> and an officer can arrest someone who is topless for disorderly conduct, but mm-hmm. not for the act of being, being topless. Good. Yeah. Is it illegal to not have a license if you own a dog? A dog license depends on where you are. Like City of Saint George requires you to have your dog licensed. What? <laughs> I, what if, I don't think so. <laughs> what if you buy it in the Walmart? <laughs> if you buy it in the parking lot of Costco from some uh, people from Colorado City. As far as I know, you still got to register is it, them. Is it legal or, or do you need a license or not? My guess is it's probably going to be another situational area dip type of dog. Because if you have a small Shih Tzu compared to a bigger dog, maybe like a rottweiler is something that's considered a more dangerous dog quote-unquote dangerous by goat you instead probably have to have some license you probably have to have a license for that too get the goat the dog isn't dangerous is the people taking care of the dog exactly <laughs> guns don't kill people people kill people <laughs> 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 might want to cut that one out <laughs> 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 the answer to that wait one. wait i think colby's right it, he I don't know why he knows that you need to have a, your dog licensed. I think that is a very small percentage of people to do. Oh, for sure. Yeah. I mean, you can get away with a lot. And but yeah, I think here, Colby's right. They don't go patrolling and checking your license. Like, if you get... A, animal control is not going to stop you if you're walking your dog like a normal police officer would, like, stop you with your car and, like, check your license stuff. They're not going to do it. They just yeah. don't. You don't carry your dog license with you? <laughs> nope. <laughs> It's what okay. dog collars for, I keep dude. mine on my dog. <laughs> so, <laughs> so consensus, legal? Situational. Sure, yeah, situational. So it is required for every individual who owns a dog to have a license for their dog because they need to have record that they have been vaccinated for rabies and that kind of stuff. Okay, that's... Okay. That's a valid Which reason. makes sense. That yeah. checks out. But, I mean, if your dog never bites anyone and never, uh, no one ever gets rabies, then you will most likely never then you'll have be fine. Never get issue. checked. Yeah. Okay. So that's... So it's, it's kind of like insurance to where it doesn't do anything until you actually need it. Kind of, yeah. Okay. I guess, if you want to phrase it that way. Yeah. Yeah. But... I Again, I look at it like a driver's license. Like, yeah, you have, you're required to have it to drive a car, like... But until you get pulled over, until it's you're, not gonna. That's it, true. It's not gonna affect you. Okay, yeah, I guess. I feel like it's more that way than insurance. But yeah, it makes sense. Ins- insurance is a fraud. Okay, I'll just say that. Using <laughs> Wi-Fi in a public restaurant. Is it public Wi-Fi? Public Wi-Fi in a public restaurant. It's legal. Or do you have to have the restaurant's consent? <laughs> if it's free and public and open, that's yeah, that's true. If it's if it, it doesn't have a password and it's public and open, then it's legal. It's legal. There's no. Just because there's no reason it shouldn't be legal, you're gonna say it's illegal. gonna say it's gonna be illegal, right? Yeah. Or is this one of the ones you're making up? No, no, no. This is oh, this is actual actual laws. Yes. Okay, that so I am not that one. contributing to. Yeah, that's that's legal. But watch it be. Yeah. So what is it? Watch it be illegal in Utah. So it is <laughs> illegal. Of course, um, it is. the rules vary from state to state. Obviously, the regulation is rarely enforced, but some have gotten in trouble. Um, even one Michigan man was fined four hundred dollars and given four hundred or forty hours of community service in two thousand seven for connecting to a cafe's internet without paying for anything. So it's illegal mm. to use their internet if, if you, you are not a if you're not a customer in whatever they're doing. Just whatever go to a library. Providing. What does it matter? <laughs> <laughs> well, somebody's got to pay for it still. Yeah. Here's another one that you guys are gonna 
Yeah. Making food with arsenic. What's that? I don't even know. Arsenic poison. It's like no. a very dangerous chemical. I only do the math. I don't do the science. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> well, you see, if you're just making the food... Sorry, that's making and selling food with arsenic. Oh, that's and illegal. Selling. <laughs> that's illegal if you're selling it to people and like purposely know. And you are aware that you are yeah. using it. It's not like Let's an accidental yeah. somehow got in there, but like you are powder puff girls like fully action. fully knowing <laughs> it's a uh, chemical X. Yeah, can remember very much. <laughs> uh, I think I yes. think it's legal as long as you advertise right. <laughs> you know, marketers. It's going to be one of those where it's it's legal, guaranteed. Yeah. So yes. With consent. It it is legal. Um, I mean, my dad. It, he's always telling me. He's like, if my mind goes, rat poison in the pudding. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> do, that he's like Justin? do me a favor. <laughs> he's like, it won't get traced back to you. I get to go. Done. Okay. <laughs> so here's here's the kicker. The FDA has released statements about the presence of arsenic in rice, apples, and all organic fruits, but like. Uh, unlike countries of the European Union, the U.S. has no ban on arsenic in our food. Hmm. So you could create food. Like, with how arsenic. deadly is that to you, though? Like, uh, well, because what, what amount stuff. could kill you? The amount in rice, apples, and whatever is that the only two? Yeah, yeah. those. It's not a lot, but like, if you it's put like arsenic in water, existing? it's really bad. Yeah, it's naturally existing. Oh. Okay, so if you, if you. Have no a, additive. Yeah, you're not yeah. adding. Okay. I, I should have specified. If yeah. you are growing plants and there is arsenic oh, okay. in it. Okay. Yeah. 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 So yeah. I mean, that we, makes more sense. Because if you think about it, we technically consume toxic stuff all the time. It's just the ratios. A 44 mm. ounce Diet Coke in my Stanley Cup. With a Twinkie. <laughs> With a Twinkie. <laughs> Dipping it in there. <laughs> Deep fried and smothered with chocolate. Are you guys talking about a specific thing? Because that went over my head. No. Okay. What is going on? Just shot. I was like, there is too straight of a line. Too straight of a line for you guys to have just made that up. That's how good I'm, we are, Matt. I'm out of breath from <laughs> pretending to hyperventilate. I don't want to give you mouth to mouth, and I don't want to get Kara in here, so stay upright. <laughs> She's right. probably the most qualified. <laughs> probably, True. actually. Yeah, actually. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah, so if it was going to go, it better be me, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Marrying your cousin. Depends on where you're at. No, no, what, no, no, no. What, what cousin it is. First cousin, second states, cousin. All 50 states. What is it? First cousin. First cousin. It's illegal. Um, with consent, it's legal. <laughs> With consent, there's you're al- from there Alabama. Always, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. there I've, always I've has heard to be about consent. This. It's like if you are past a certain age or something like that, and there's certain huh. context. Your parents things can that just have to take marry you place. off. No consent. I mean, it's Twenty goats. I mean, it, it, there's like something <laughs> to do with age or something like that. <laughs> something has to happen, and it ends up being legal for the most part, or something like that. Hey, Darren, in certain situations, I know second cousins and past that <laughs> it's completely that. legal, no matter what. <laughs> First cousins, it's like a gray area. Okay. Everyone else's thoughts? I I have no idea. <laughs> I like it shouldn't be a thing, but it's probably a thing because who's to say who can and can't get married, you know? Yeah. So it is actually a hundred percent legal <laughs> in all states. I don't know what you're Fashioned. coming up with with that whole age thing. But I just well, I you're saw. using <laughs> Oh, so yeah, no. I, I, my, my sources aren't <laughs> the most credible. I will put that out there. If I am no wrong, government I am agency. sorry. It is not a government-stated thing. It is a person posting about laws. So if mm. I am wrong, Yeah, I nothing apologize. in this episode it's will factual. hold up in any <laughs> court of your law. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Disclaimer there. Cha-ching. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and while we're, while we're on that subject, um, the, remember, it does not hold up in court of law. Hitting, slapping, or even whipping a child. <laughs> I thought it was going a different way. <laughs> Dad is was like, with consent. <laughs> <laughs> you can't, can't use that one here. <laughs> um, a child. That's assault child, anyways. Can I, can so I, well, it depends how hard. Are you hitting? <laughs> <laughs> Tanner, um, I'm glad I'm not going to be your kid. Because, like, well, think about it. <laughs> Ow. I just slapped you, right? I could slap a lot harder, <laughs> but 
if it leaves the mark. And like whipping, like whipping with what? Like a belt? Yeah. Discipline. Yes. That's completely legal. Should be. <laughs> well, I don't know. I'm saying I'm saying it's legal. It's probably another one of those, but it's probably going to be illegal. I'm going to say legal. I'll it's just legal. say illegal. I'll just stick with my answer. If you're not doing permanent damage, like if you just... What about the physical and mental, emotional, emotional. <laughs> BS that That's what I'm saying if you're not doing permanent lasting damage. <laughs> <laughs> I would drop a lot of times. I'm sure it was lasting. <laughs> oh, it was, buddy. It was. <laughs> But that's okay. We're helping you through it. <laughs> we love you just the same. So <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> it is considered legal <clears throat> with this like context. Context. So yeah, kicking, slapping, whipping is legal as long as it is considered reasonable discipline by a parent or caretaker with consent. Yes. <laughs> no, I don't think not so. With, with <laughs> I don't think the kid's gonna give you consent. <laughs> The kid hey, they might be into that freaky stuff. You don't know. <laughs> oh, no. Colby, no. <laughs> you might want to have this next week's episode. Chains and whips <laughs> excite me. <laughs> Instead of Just a that was easy button, Colby needs a cha-ching button. <laughs> so now we're going to quickly run into did Matthew make these laws or are they actual laws in at least one state? In the U.S. at one, like at some point in time. Time out. Do you for, prefer to be called Matthew or Matt? Uh, whichever you prefer. Okay. Because your wife and my wife always call you Matthew, and you refer to yourself as Matthew, <laughs> just barely. Well, we've but, always called you Matt. But yeah. it has always been Matt. I make fun of Kara for saying Matthew. <laughs> like, I have said Matthew, Matthew before. <laughs> yeah. But it's, it's very rare. Yeah. Extremely rare that I call Sometimes you Matthew. Sometimes it'll slip out, and I'm like, what? who is what? Matthew? <laughs> Matthew? I'm talking about Matt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I don't care. Okay. okay. I refer to myself as Matthew, giving people the opportunity to call me Matt, because I feel like if I call myself Matt, people don't think they're never going to gonna call go me Matthew. Matthew. Yes. Gotcha. All right. Check it out. Okay. So. Okay. All right, Matthew. Matthew. Rapid fire. Okay. I felt wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it is illegal to kill Bill F- or Bigfoot? That's le- legal. That's legal. Le- legal. No, like that's a real, real or thing. fake. No, real. Oh, thing. true. Real. True. True. Okay. Can you guess what state? Wyoming. Oregon. North Dakota. North Washington. North Dakota. No. Oh, I knew it was okay. Northwest. <laughs> Using a fork for a soup. That's got to be illegal. That's, that's got to be a real thing. That's real. Wait, using a fork, fork is for illegal? a soup? Yeah, oh, I think it's illegal. Situa- it's, no, that's, it's, 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 it's that's a real, real law. Real or fake Real, law. real or fake Real. Law. That's real. That, that, that wasn't a law. That was half a sentence. Use, <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> We're doing real fork. or fake laws. We're not doing is it legal or illegal. It's Is this a legit thing or did Matthew make it up? Did I make it up or is we it went something over that actually happened? <laughs> okay, say it again slowly. <laughs> Small is it, words. Is it a law in at least one state in the U.S. or did I make it up on the top of my head? Using a no, fork? Using a fork to eat or soup. a soup. To eat soup. It's real. It's a real thing. It's real. It better be this is real. Pass. I don't understand. <laughs> I made it up. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> it is illegal. illegal to eavesdrop. Yes. Depends on where. <laughs> it's well, yes, yes, a that's, state. that's the There's point. One state. <laughs> I'm gonna say this is a real thing. Yes, a real thing in Oklahoma. It is illegal to eavesdrop on someone if you are planning to hurt them or vex them in some kind of way. Yes, you always have consent. something. Okay. How is the you can't sneak up on it anybody. It is illegal to make toast in anything but a toaster. That's um, a Matthew law. No, this is a real law. In Idaho. No, it, it doesn't have anything to do with potatoes. How's that Idaho? Real That's law. True. Real true. law. Sorry. It's fake law. I made it up. Yes. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> no mask wearing unless you are at a party. Real law. Real what law. Kind of masks. Any kind of mask. Masquerade ball. It's this is a fake law. It's a real law. What? In New York. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no bartering Band-Aids. infant children. No that, that's bartering, real, that's trying a, to sell. That's a real law. That's a real law. It's called human. In trafficking. Pennsylvania. It's called human trafficking. <laughs> yes. Okay. Colby. <laughs> Sorry. I just you got, me riled, you got me riled up tonight. <laughs> No festivals to be one. held. Wait, without, wait, 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 wait. What? Sorry, what? No festivals to be held without a hired DJ. That's a Matthew law. That's a Matt law. It's a Matthew law. It's real. It's a Matt law. Ah. Okay. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Just think anything's real and I'm always breaking them. <laughs> quote, unquote, idiots cannot vote. 
Uh, this is a Matthew that's law. That's a Matt law. It should law. be a real law, but it's not. Now I'm saying Matthew. What's going on? Yeah, right? <laughs> Ow. Well, Wait, he's because he said, is it a Matthew idiots. law? Uh, it's a real law. law. It is a real, was a real law in New Mexico. It has since been changed where they do not use that term. New Mexico. Mm. What do they use instead? It's New Mexico I, I has know. the <laughs> lowest graduation rate in the entire country. <laughs> <laughs> to define idiots? <laughs> <laughs> no wonder they got the governor they got. <laughs> hey, hey. They're not idiots. They're... <laughs> Need special help. <laughs> you got to cut that one. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. It is illegal to use a cactus while interrogating someone. Oh, uh, that's 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 real. That's your real law. False. That's my law. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you must funny. sing the national anthem correctly. True. What define Valid. correctly? Okay, correctly define meaning correctly. with no kind of variation. It is oh, that's, that's saying fake law. as it is written. Fake I think that's law. real. And anybody that's ever sang it in an NFL game, lock them up. It's real. Sorry, Fergie. Nope. Fake. What state? That wasn't NFL. It was, it was real. NBA. It was, was real. It was the All Star game. Um, uh, Pennsylvania, South Dakota, Florida, Tennessee. What's a patriotic state? Kentucky. Is, is New England a state? No. Which where is New England at? It's a, it's a, a cluster. East. Yeah, the Northeast is like it's a cluster of areas like, like Delaware, Boston. Maine, that area. Think of Massachusetts. Where are the New Patriots York? from? Up. New England Patriots. <laughs> <laughs> what state <laughs> is it? In? Gillette Field is in Boston. Yeah. Yes. It's All right, Boston. 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 <laughs> Boston. Massachusetts <laughs> is the state, which is correct. Oh, let's go! <laughs> Boston is the state. <laughs> No, Massachusetts. You said Massachusetts, you idiot. I know you said Boston. That's because that's where the, the stadium is. Within Massachusetts. Okay. We're right. Good teamwork. <laughs> it is illegal to hunt on Sunday, <laughs> except for if you are hunting raccoons. Um, that's this real. This is legal in Idaho. It is real in Idaho. Wait, ra- Fake law. It is real. It is real. Ah, in Virginia. Yeah. Oh, wow. Um, you cannot buy a firearm without also purchasing the ammunition to go with it. That's real. No, that's that's made up. You can buy a firearm without buying ammo for it. In it's certain real. states. Well, it is fake. <laughs> oh. Uh, I, I would have figured, like, <laughs> they asked if you some want there was some some state for that it. It like, is illegal to sprint through a restaurant. It's that. That's... It depends on the restaurant. If it's sit down, no. But if it's fast food, yeah. Because it's fast. <laughs> it's fast. <laughs> Let me tell Tell's you, up and down those play places at McDonald's, I was sprinting. <laughs> Could be real. I made it up. Oh. Probably restaurant policy. Wearing socks with sandals. That is. That better be a real law. That is comfortable. That is a fake law. It is a fake law. Illegal to cause catastrophe. That's true. That's real. That that's that's a real thing. Because yeah. you can't yell fire in a crowded movie theater. You can't yell shark in a crowded beach because that Today's causes chaos. Today's going to save lives. What what, <laughs> what state? Uh, all of them. Okay. What state specifically uses the terms "cause catastrophe"? Arizona. No. I feel like they're weird. It's Oregon. Washington. Okay. Utah. I was going to oh, say Utah. Utah. All righty. Can't walk out to San Hall and yell shark, you know. I think that is all of our quick fire, real or fake laws. Right on. So we're getting on the cruise ship, and I'm pointed down at a big old clump of seaweed, and I was like, "Look at the gators!" And Kara was like, "No way!" She's taking pictures of them. It's a good thing you weren't in Utah, because it would have been illegal for you to cause catastrophe. Good thing. But now we know. There are some wacky laws out there. The more you some know. you have to watch out for because apparently you're doing it on a daily and it's illegal. Kitching. Yeah. <laughs> like Catching. Alabama, you can't have a, uh, an ice cream cone in your back pocket on a Sunday. And Walking others <laughs> that just exist because specific people did them and Tanner somehow knows. And some of these other ones, Matt needs to be elected a representative to make these laws real. True. I've always I'll wanted to be it. the cause of like a, a warning label, you know? <laughs> Darren, you probably are somewhere. <laughs> probably. <laughs> or like the warning labels you get on lacrosse equipment can cause yes. injury. Well, well duh, duh. That's why I'm getting it. <laughs> sure hope it. so. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we thank you guys for joining us today on this podcast, and we, we hope to see you guys next week.
Deuces. Bye. Adios. See ya.